This video is going to take you through the process of downloading and installing SketchUp 2016. We start on the website sketchup.com. I'm going to leave you to explore through the website at your leisure. There's a lot of information, menus here, and also uh, further information down here. But the bit that we want is right up at the top, right hand side, big red button says download SketchUp, and we're going to be doing that first thing that it's going to ask us for is to choose a product and it's going to say what are we using the, educate the SketchUp for we're going to be using it for educational use please click that it's then going to ask us to tell us a bit about them or tell them a bit about ourselves so educational use here you need to enter your email address please enter it in the form of name at school dot edu dot au Alright, please use your school email address. You'll notice I haven't typed in our correct school or email address in the correct format, and that's because this is a, going to be a public video and we may not wish to release that information. So use the school email address that you have. Uh, you can choose whether you want to receive SketchUp news and tips. Uh, if you don't, just deselect that. Enter your first name, your last name, the name of the school, and then you need to come here and select that you are a student. Uh, you need to indicate whether you're going to be using it on a Windows or Mac computer. Uh, mine is a Windows computer. And then we need to you choose the product. And the choices are SketchUp Pro or SketchUp Make. The difference between, they actually say over here, SketchUp Make is recommended and completely free for K-12 students and educators. SketchUp Pro is recommended and highly discounted for college students and educators. Well, we want free. So we're going to go for SketchUp Make. Once you've done that, you're going to have to agree to the license agreement. Go ahead and read it first. And then you're going to hit the button that says Download SketchUp. It won't let me do that right now because I haven't filled in the correct information. But I have done it before. And when you do, this is the screen that's going to come up. And it describes the process now as Step 1, double-click SketchUp EXE installer file. It's probably in your Downloads folder, and I'll show you that in a minute. Uh, follow the installer instructions uh, and it says you can do it yeah it's dead simple and find SketchUp icon on your desktop so step one double click on this uh, SketchUp EXE installer file it's probably in your downloads folder so you can come over here and you can go to downloads and I've done that already it's sitting there I have my install file here all I need to do is double click and the installation should begin. It starts with a little window that just shows that the installer software is being run and being unpacked. And then this window will pop up. It says, Welcome to SketchUp Max um, Setup Wizard. You click on the button that says Next. It's going to ask you where you want to install it. Now, I'm not going to change it for Windows. It goes in the program file SketchUp, SketchUp 2016. You can change it if you need to. I'm quite happy with that. You click Next and it says install so that's all there is that you need to do you click on install you sit back and you wait and we should start up on the next one of how to fire up sketchup and get it set up and so that's the end of this video you should have a set uh, an installed version of sketchup 2016 by the time this wizard has finished running